have a look at these jeans, aren't they great? Well, I'd say we should rather shop around a bit. Wow, so I can spend even more money? Okay, I'll find another pair of jeans. Shopping around means I think this shop is too expensive and we should look for jeans elsewhere and compare prices in other shops. Whoa, these jeans, it's a steal! You think so? Well, I've never stolen anything in my life, but I can try if you tell me so. Are you nuts? Do you want to have a criminal record? It's a steal, means it's a great bargain, it's very cheap, and you shouldn't think twice before buying these. Excuse me, I'd like to measure these. Are you blind? Why would you need to measure these jeans if it says the size on the tag? Excuse me, I'd like to put these jeans on. Well, technically you said it correctly, but there is a better way to tell the shop assistant that you would like to see if these jeans fit you. Excuse me, I'd like to try these jeans on. No problem, the changing room is down there, at the back. Hi, excuse me, do you have a cloak room here? If you're heading to a conference, you've entered the wrong building, sir. Excuse me, do you have a place where I can try these on? Very good. If you're not sure of the exact word in English, use other words to describe it. But I want you to try harder. Excuse me, is there a fitting room around here? Yeah, sure, just follow me and I'll show you. Hold on, hold on. I think they robbed us. These jeans are too expensive. Hold on, if you were robbed, how come you still have your wallet in the pocket? Hold on, hold on. I think they cheated us. These jeans are too expensive. All right, I got you. But I still want you to use a phrasal verb used in real life English conversations. Hold on, hold on. I think we were ripped off. These jeans are too expensive. Well, didn't I tell you to shop around? Next time, you'll think twice before buying the first thing.